Yes, but if you know you don't like stress, please don't bother coming to Lagos. This bear money is made. No more Lagos money. You make it here. You finish it here. Oh. Lagos people are nice. Collect your change. Open your eyes. Oh. This Lagos. If you want no road, forget. No loss be that. Hi, this is again. What's up, Bob? And what's popping? How are you guys doing? It's been a long time since I vlogged last and trust me it was intentional I'm even doing this on today because I just felt like okay let me just give you guys an update of my staying in Lagos so like I was saying I came to Lagos for an interview only for <laughs> Ben stop I'm making a video for YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> I swear it's not feeling, I'm not even feeling the vibe because it's been a long ass while. I swear, the video way you just give up on YouTube, I don't understand. It's not my fault. Like I was saying, guys, I literally came to Lagos for an interview, and honestly speaking, I knew deep down one part of me knew that I was going to get the job. The other part was just like, okay, I've been to a lot of interviews, but long story short i had to stay in lagos with no clothes nothing nothing i had no plans i just felt like i was coming for an interview and i was going to go back to ibadan only for me to have this interview the same day and i got the job that same day and long story short today is march what i think march 7 8 or certain or thereabout it's been two blessed months in lagos and i can't complain there's been a lot of ups and downs the expensive lifestyle in Lagos. I'm just lucky that my workplace is not far from where I stay. That's the good part of this whole Lagos lifestyle thing. But I appreciate the fact that I have a you know supporting system, a loving person that is the hard life. <laughs> Sometimes, but we are not giving up. We keep pushing. It's not easy, but we keep pushing. And I will make a proper video later explaining to you guys. You know. My life in Lagos, how it has been, ups and downs, all the good, the bad, and the ugly. I'll explain to you guys much later. But that being said, I am heading to work right now. People are looking at me and it's so strange. So I'm just gonna end this video. I just want to let you guys know that I relocated to Lagos, okay? The Ibado girl is no more Ibado girl. The Ibado girl is now ah it's the noise for me. Try and make clips with my colleagues and ask them like they're live in Lagos, how it has been. I'll add it to this clip and let you guys. My name is Jorala Marvelous. How long have you been in Lagos? Uh, just two months. I hope you enjoy your stay in Lagos. Uh, not really. It was one bad experience you've had. <laughs> one bad experience is that <laughs> there is no bus early in the morning when I'm coming to work. Where are you coming from? I'm coming from Hacha. So what would you, what advice would you give anyone? Okay, where, did, where, where exactly did you come from? Before? I came from Oshun State. Okay, so what advice would you give anybody coming to Oshun State? Coming to Oshun State or coming to Lagos State? Coming to Lagos State. Yeah. Okay, first and foremost, if you know you're ready to work, you can come to Lagos. But if you know you don't like stress, please don't bother coming to Lagos. You can either go to Oshun State, Baden, or stay in your show. Very good. Thank you very much. Thank it's you. nice to have you on our show. Thank and you, we'll Susan see you Annie. We'll see you. Thank you. What's your name? My name is Sonobia Queenie. Where are you from? I'm from Delta State. So how long have you been in Lagos? Uh, I've been in Lagos for two years, two years now. How is your experience in Lagos? It was work that brought me to Lagos. Uh, my experience, I remember the, the first experience I had coming to Lagos, I got a divorce. Then I didn't know I was supposed to collect my uh, change immediately from the driver. So I keep, I, although I keep in mind the driver, I, I changed, but I changed. The man said, don't worry. And at the end of the day, I I came down without collecting like 500, 500 though, 500, 500 and actually like it was very painful and aside that, you know, I was in Benin before, coming from Benin to Lagos, the traffic and everything man, it's crazy. So, my advice to whoever that is coming to Lagos, you must be a strong person. Strong person in the sense that there are sometimes you can stay in traffic for like 5 to 6 hours. So if you are not strong enough, definitely, I'm sure you just fell inside the bus, <laughs> sorry about that. But you must be really strong if you are coming to Lagos and um, you must be focused too. Because if you are not focused, on more Lagos money, you make it here, you finish it here. Oh. <laughs> Muri Tala, <laughs> Okay. How long have you been in Lagos? Hmm. Lagos. City of sense. <laughs> like a year now. 
So what's your experience so far? Or before that, uh, where were you before coming to Lagos? Like what state were you before coming to Lagos? So good. <laughs> so what's your experience so far? How would you so the say? thing about Lagos is that if you are not smart, you can't stay there. And you want to drum, you can't stay in Lagos. You have to be smart. You understand? And then, well, Lagos is is uh, the commercial city actually, like state shop, because this is where money is made. And then, actually, in Lagos, if if you are not um, the saving type, you just squander your money. Hi, my name is Esther Bagua. Uh, what's it like? I'll say four months. Are you enjoying your stay in Lagos? Uh, it's just here today is wild, tomorrow is. <laughs> Where did you come from? Like before getting to Lagos? Which oh, uh, those days we need to be precise. <laughs> so, what would you advise anybody coming to Lagos? Um, just be strong, be ready to, especially that bus bus drivers. They will carry your change, collect your change, open your eyes. They will give you. Just be ready, be agile. If not. They go put you down. <laughs> That's all. <laughs> Neka. I've been in Lagos for the past 20 years. Yeah. And living in Lagos has been quite an experience for me. Right from growing up, having to carry my brother on my two legs in the bus from Mushi to Egbe. And then coming back again. Then we moved from Mushi down to Sumeri to Egbe to school. So, Living in Lagos has been quite an experience. It's not easy, but you have to be like you have to be really strong. You have to have you have to be pay, that, that patient time to be able to maneuver your way in this Lagos. If you don't know no road, forget you don't lost the that. You don't lost. So coming to Lagos, you have to be extremely smart. If you're not smart, you will fall into the hands of criminals, ritualists. They are everywhere. They are everywhere. And you need to be even more prayerful. You need to be prayerful before you leave the house and before you even get home. Just be, be prayerful. It's only grace that can carry you through this Lagos, through this Lagos life. That's it. It's only grace that can carry you through this Lagos life. If you don't have grace, forget it. If you know you can't, Oga, Madam, back to your states. Let you know say you fit. Be safe. Thank you. You're welcome. My name is Chika Regina. Where did you come from? Um, Enugu State. Like the, you came from Enugu to Lagos. Yes. How long have you been in Lagos? Um, let's say five months now. So how is your experience so far? Wow, it's been wonderful, but it's been horrible as well. Yeah. Well, meeting people, it's fun, but here it's difficult for them to associate with you. They feel like maybe your good morning is going to turn with you, with you for them. But apart from that, Lagos people are nice, but you just have to be smart with them. If not, ah. Uh, they will do you. <laughs> so, what advice would you give anyone coming from Enugu to Lagos for greener pasture? Well, I will just have to start a person to be strong-willed, hard work, and person to be determined. Because the intimidation that the person will get, oh god, it will be much. But once you are strong-willed and strong-hearted, you overcome those things. Thank you. Just, you know, this is just an update, a live update, okay? I moved to Lagos and I'm enjoying it. I can't complain. Thank you so much and I love you guys so much. Always remember to love what you do, do what you love. Be yourself, love yourself and believe in yourself. My hand is paining me and I'll see you guys in my next video. Ciao.